the plight of rape women as casualties of war is given credence only at the emotion of the moment when the side of danger, the side in danger of annihilation cries out to the world's attention. When military histories are written, when glorious battles for independence become legend, the stories are glossed over, discounted as exaggerations, deemed not serious enough in, for inclusion in scholarly works, and the women are left with their shame. Um, thanks a lot. That's all I have to say. And um, our zine is called Illusional Felines. And if you come up to either myself or Ariana, um, we have, I wrote to a women's group in Croatia, and I have um, about five or six first hand accounts of women who were kept in rape camps in Croatia, which I think you should all read. So please come up to either myself or Ariana afterwards. Thank you. We've got a lot of bad publicity by people who didn't e either didn't understand or who came to meetings wishing to um, slag on Riot Girl. And all I'm saying is here to talk to all the girls here. We're here to support to create a supportive environment which women can get together and talk. It's not about man ba bashing. It's not about a fashion statement or another clip. A lot of girls just want to have somebody hear their stories, to have somebody who won't condescend to them, who will listen to them, and who will understand. I went to Riot Girl with a lot of doubts, and um, I'm not one for joining organizations because I don't follow party lines. And that's a really cool thing about Riot Girls, it's just an individual, it's just a way to help yourself. And I found a real support base there, people who will listen to me, and um, scarily enough, a lot of people have very similar stories as I do, and have had a lot of similar experiences with their family, with their boyfriends, with other men. Um, unfortunately, we went to a show, the Bikini Kill show on Friday, and um, sexually harassed, assaulted, and um, afterwards were fucked with by the police when we tried to file reports against um, the men who had harassed us. We had one guy put away for sexual harassment who had been going to shows for the past several months, and um, he's not the only one. I've been harassed by several guys at shows who only go to punk shows to feel up girls. And it's really disgusting. And what we, our option was to create a place where girls, where a group of girls would be by the stage. And because we're sick of going to punk shows and being pushed away by guys who feel need to like put off their excess testosterone in the pit, but then they come and push everybody else around. All we want is a place to dance without being felt up, without having people put their hands in our crotches, which happened to me both of those other shows, which happened to me a million shows before that. And um, so at any shows, if girls want to get together, um, if I'm there, if anybody else, just get together, create an environment where guys are not going to come and shove you out of their way. And um, to all the guys, because I know a lot of guys get shoved and pushed and kicked anyway. If you want a pit, I'm totally down with that. That's totally cool. But if you're just there for the pit, you don't have to be in the front of the stage because you're just there to push each other around. Go towards the back or something. Let the people who are there to enjoy the music and dance around, dance in front of the stage. Um, the other thing I was just saying, just. Anybody who's interested in Riot Girl can come up to me or Silcha. Um, we can give you some information. There are other Riot Girls here. If you'd like to just get together and talk and meet other girls um, who, will, who will understand and just want to talk to you. Because LA is a very hard place to meet women. You're always brought along as somebody's girlfriend or so and so. We're always taught that we're competition for the guys in the scene. And that's really fucked up because I don't even think a lot of guys are down with that. They don't want us all being like little catty bitches who glare at each other and go, well, she's such a bitch, blah, blah, blah. You know, and this is a place where you're not going to be judged on how fucking punk you are, or how your teeth are, or how thin you are, or whose girlfriend you are. You're there judged to be on your own individual basis. Nobody's going to sit down there and look down at you. So please, just give Riot Girl a chance if you're interested, if you want somebody to talk to. Because a lot of us have our best friends, but it's kind of like having a lot of best friends to talk to. And um, just feel welcome to come to any meeting. You know, come up to us and get information if you're interested. Thank you. Woo!